Hello friends, we're going to be measuring with our feet. All right, friends, it's time for Mighty Minutes. And today's Mighty Minutes is called Measuring with Feet. Now, you can do this with your feet in your shoes or you can take your shoes off and do it that way. So I wonder how many feet tall you are. So this requires um, partner work. So if you want to measure your child and then have your child measure you, you would demonstrate to them how to measure with one foot and let's see, one foot in front of the other. Sorry, doing it in the camera is backwards, so it's a little tricky. So show them how to um, you know place one foot and then place the next foot with their Oh, and their heel, and then do the next one, and um, just keep going. And as they do that, they count how many feet um, you are. You can also measure other things as well. Um, for example, you can see how far it is from that door to the wall, or um, you know, just anything you have around the house that you want to measure. You could see um, how many feet a box, you know, maybe you have a big box, see how many feet the box is. Um, so there's different things you can measure. Um, then you can also um, measure with other items such as a block or um, a book or if it's small items you could use um, a paper clip or a pencil things like that so be creative so um, the object is to measure objects now there's a standard a standard measurement which would be with a ruler I'll show you with a ruler so this would be a standard measurement because it's got so all rulers are the same measurement so that would be called a standard measurement then you also have a non-standard measurement for example your feet because my feet and your feet are not the same. They're going to be different sizes. So if you measure something with my feet, it's not going to be the same number as measuring it with your feet. And that's why it's called a non-standard. Now, if you measured something with the ruler, it's going to be, and then I measured it with the ruler, it's going to be the same number or it should be the same number anyway. So that's, the difference between a standard and a non-standard measurement. So I hope you enjoyed today's video. Have fun measuring with your feet and other objects. Don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button and I'll see you on the next video. Bye.